peace love and light to you my scorpios welcome to my channel my single scorpios welcome to my channel i'm butterfly tarot and inside of butterfly and i'm here to give you your reading for september 2020 remember this is a general reading so that means that some things may resonate while my others may not or this very well may not be your story maybe you talk about your story just plainly not your story if you're new to my channel, like the content on my channel, like comment, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell to be updated. And if you're returning to my channel, thank you for returning, excuse me, and supporting me. I truly, truly appreciate each and every one of you. Okay. So I want to know what's going on with you. What's up with you? What's up? King of Cups in reverse, so you could be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, <clears throat> like yourself, or this represents you, saying that um, you could be jealous, uh, insecure, uh, withdrawing your emotions, your love and your affection, excessively needy. This could be you, the person you're dealing with, okay? King of Cups in reverse is not a good dude. He's a blithering mess when it comes to his emotions sometimes. Or he'd be kind of cold and callous and cutting himself off from people, places, and things when things do not serve his heart. First card out, four swords, withdraw. Withdrawing, going into contemplation mode. Crossing energy, the knight of swords are reversed. So there could be an, a lie that you found out or you're tired of arguing and fighting. Six of wands, the situation you're dealing with, you feel so that there was a lack of success, okay? That has caused you to seal up your heart concerning this person. Ooh, that's too many. Hold on. Thanks. Oh, that fell out. Pass energy. Listen to pass energy from my dear Scorpios. your car cancer crisis scorpio so back in the past you've had a lot of love for this person you are very loving nurturing energy towards this person okay but it looks like you had to leave them behind why is that karma thoughts because they were lying to you and they were ch i want to say cheating you found out that this person was lying to you, that they were putting up a front, that they were not who they said they were. And you felt very defensive while being in this relationship with this person. You could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, but the King of Pentacles in reverse is saying that this person was a very controlling, lying, manipulative energy. And you know this. And it's saying with the Seven of Wands that you don't know how to deal with this. And they could have been hypersexual as well. 
that you stood your ground to protect yourself from those underneath you but it was like you didn't know how to guard yourself against that person so that's why you have cut off your emotion, emotions towards them and you have taken a break from them because you know that there's a lack of success and that this person when you do deal with them they never speak the truth that they are contagious liars what's about to happen the justice card the page of pentacles and the three of cups so it's saying that this person's going to try to reunite with you because they want to do right by you but it's saying that they will not be able to do right by them because the only point of them coming back to you is so that you could end up taking care of them okay so what is it that this person cares concerning their connection with you my dear scorpios like these decks are trying to like tell half of the deck I just want to I'm having mad poppers today. Ace of Pentacles and Temperance? What? How was that fear or concern? Or maybe it is that they are afraid that they will not be able to have a new start with you. Something that is going to be balanced, but also something that's going to be stable. That they are afraid that they will not be able to give you what it is that you want, which is stability and balance. So the person you're dealing with is like, they can't provide for you. Okay? How they see your situation, those who are attached to you both. Nine of Cups in reverse, a lack of wish fulfillment that you're both not fulfill within your relationships with each other or just life in general that you're just like on autopilot just going through the motions and yet you are not truly fulfilled what they wish for star card reverse a lack of healing maybe it is that they're wishing for to fix something that is broken the four of cups and, and the upright so it's saying that being feeling of being betrayed, or not betrayed, just discontent. That is saying that you, you're the person you're dealing with is wishing that they could heal the situation, but they feel so they can't. That is something that requires too much work in order for it to work. It could be talking about somebody who may be suffering from health issues, but with the Four of Cups, there is just telling me that this person is like bored with how life is going now and they feel like that there's a lot of healing that needs to be done within this relationship so what's going to be the outcome for my dear Scorpios page of swords I want another one please tell me why this page of swords is here four of wands hmm. so, are you married and they're not Y'all were fooling around. Was there a fling at a fling fling? Three, uh, okay. So this person wants to reconcile with you. They want to reconcile. They want to come back. Head of hearts, decision, king of swords. This person wants to come back. and they're, they're looking in on you. They're checking on you. They want to, I'm going to just peek. Okay, one more. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Cool. Alright, so it's saying that this person, literally, this person wants to marry you. They want to know if you're in a relationship or not. They're going to be spying on you to see if you're in a relationship or not because they would like to come back to you. And they want to do justice by you. They want to step into their power to do justice by you, okay? Um, to recover this relationship, three swords are reversed. And with the king of swords, it's saying that this person is willing to cut off persons, persons places or things that may try to get into the way of your relationship they are keeping a close eye on you because this person sees their future with you and they would like a reconciliation okay so you're you, you guys might want to reconcile with you my dear Scorpios all right be careful because somebody might be trying to hit you with the whoa 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 with the sacral chakra or chakra so it's saying be careful because again you might be investing your time and your energy in something that's not going to give you back what you want 
the seven of wands in reverse feeling helpless and defenseless against the situation but at the same time you have the nine of pentacles saying that you're going to have well-deserved rewards being self-sufficient that if you have a home business get it on a pop in because it's about to be producing some money for you but with the sun card in the reverse is saying that to be mindful that the sun does not revolve around you that you have to put in your effort in order to make your own self shine but it's also saying that that things are difficult right now okay it could be talking about a lack of happiness but it's saying that it's difficult right now and what you're going through is going to be a difficult struggle protect your private parts because somebody may not be trying to get you pregnant to keep you or it's just saying that you know tap down deep inside be grounded in everything you do from your ground your root chakra all the way up to your crown chakra circle chakra is talking about your sexual organs um, your reproductive system we are entering into Mars retrograde which will deals with the reproductive system so very well may be easy even at whatever age to get pregnant or you may become hypersexual and be having relations with people who are not equally aligned with you on the spiritual level so you need to watch out for what's going on on the inside of you and what's going on on the outside in the world and in and, and, and the atmosphere the planet the planets around us get down with these retrograde y'all seriously yeah you're going to be in a situation where you're still going to find yourself putting in more work than you need to i'm going to pull two of these i'm going to get by this reading engagement Woo! didn't i tell you that they wanted to marry i told you they wanted to marry your ass where did it go Woo! bam yeah, they want to marry you. I did say that. It says your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. This person, what did they see you as marriage material? Make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps uh, you're guided to take. So you got to make the effort. It's going to take a lot of work. Because you got you, what's the point of you getting married? Pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. One more. Find finances and career financial issues are a factor in your love life right now so it's saying that you got to get grounded and stable you gotta you know um this person wants to marry you but they can't come in until their finances are right but <laughs> all right that's okay news it's not wonderful news it's okay news that they know they messed up and they want to come back and they want to fix it and only thing is it's going to take its time because you got a lot to, that needs to be fixed all right that is your reading for you my dear Scorpio. thank you for joining me once again and um huh i look forward to you all joining me in the next reading as i always say peace love and light to each and every one of you Thank you for joining me. I will see you in the next reading. Peace and so much love. Thank you and goodbye.